Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Shaving with Rich. I'm excited about this episode today because I'm going to be talking about um, end of year 2019. We're heading into 2020. It's an exciting time and it's a time that we kind of look back and we reflect. I'm going to be making several videos between now and the end of the year and uh, it's going to be great. It'll be kind of a looking back on 2019 uh type videos and it should be a lot of fun today i'm gonna be shaving uh in this video because i need to shave <clears throat> so anyways it's gonna be a great great episode i'm gonna be telling you about one of the new up and coming youtube uh wet shavers in the industry and uh that i feel that i've seen basically just explode in a very short amount of time and you may want to take a look and see, uh, check out these other channels that I recommend to you in this video. So, that being said, let's talk about the shave. Uh, what we're going to be getting into today, I'm going to be shaving with a Mercur Future. This is one of my early favorites right out of the gate. In fact, my very first video on YouTube that I ever, ever did was a review on this razor right here. Here. So I've loved it from the get-go um, and it, my thoughts about it have never changed, never wavered. I love the razor. It's awesome. It's one of my favorites. Um, so anyways, with that, I have it paired with a Wilkinson Sword, a Gillette Wilkinson Sword blade. And this is a saloon pack. These are made in India. I have some others that are made in China. I expect these blades to be fairly similar, um, but today I'll actually be able to find out. Maybe I'll save those comments for um, another video, but I expect it to be a pretty smooth shaver. We'll find out. I have my uh, recurrent future set to just setting one, but even on setting one, you can see that, I mean, this thing starts out more aggressive than most razors, but don't let that scare you. I have other videos that talk to you about how to shave with this razor and make it one of your favorites so uh anyways with that let's get into our video um so the one that recommended this week so this week in uh, rich man shaving group on facebook my group um we have a lot of fun people from all over the world uh you know just getting together having a great time and uh, shaving is kind of uh, the forefront and center of it. But we have a guy in there. His name is Mel Kyanen. You'll meet him. He does every week. He comes up with something fun in the group. Just a theme for us to kind of get behind. You know, just to kind of build unity amongst uh, people. We call it a brotherhood. Uh, it's just fun. Um, anyways, you'll get to know Mel. Now, Mel has a couple of YouTube channels. He does have a wet shaving channel which i'll list in the comments below but one thing that you may not know is he also is big into fitness so i'm going to show you my shirt this is my melfit shirt it's actually melfit family so um so his channel on youtube is mel fitness journey if you guys are coming on to the new year and you're thinking like you've been thinking that one of your new year's resolutions is going to be I want to do something uh, to get in better shape. You probably want to take a look at um, Mel's fitness journey on YouTube. It's incredible. Um, and, uh, well, you can judge for yourself. This guy has a lot of positive energy. And uh, I think you'll really enjoy it. So, that being said, that's all I'm going to say about Mel in this video. But you'll get to know him in person in the group. And he's awesome so just part of the family so let's uh get a little bit of water on the face i already um i'm four minutes into this video no worries all right so we're gonna get into the shave um let me show you what i have whipped up i already uh let me just um i'll just show you a little bit real quick but i've got a, a lot of lather right here uh, ready to go for this shave 
So it's set aside, but you're like, well, what, what shaving soap did you use, Rich? Well, I use Christmas Eve from Sterling. It's incredible. Um, Christmas scent, a pine forward scent, of course, with a, a bunch of other uh, scents included. But for me, I wanted to sweeten it up a little bit. And so, so I've got, I've got another seasonal soap. It's, it's basically, it's space nog. So this is a sweeter soap. It's a uh, seasonal around the Christmas time, eggnog and bay rum. So actually I kind of put them together and they smell good to me. So I combine that, um, and that's already whipped up, ready to go. So let's get into the shaving room. I'm going to actually tell you about the new and upcoming wet shaver on YouTube that you should check out and see what you think. But if you're like me, I think you're gonna agree that this person has a lot going for them. They have grown very fast. Um, one of the fastest that I've seen in the wet shaving community to date. So anyways, um, I got this loaded up here. This is actually one of my Black Friday brushes uh, that I had on my, my, um, yeah, it smells good on my Etsy page and actually for at this very moment as we're speaking uh, I've kind of uh, taken everything down off of the Etsy just um, I'll, I'll put everything back on but for the little window of time I just uh, wanted to spend a little bit more time with the family and enjoy this time I have two kids at birthdays the same week as Christmas anyways let's get some good lather on my face for this first pass now for the first pass I really think that it's uh, important to get a, a good amount of lather because that's where you have the most amount of growth Anyways, enough about that for this video. Let's talk about the video. So who is this new up and coming uh, wet shaver on YouTube? Rich? Well, his name is Tim Delaney. Tim Delaney. You'll find him on YouTube. And he's actually his YouTube channel name is the scented soldier shaves on youtube check it out it's uh, primarily a shaving channel but he also what's really unique about tim and what he does is and i think he's onto something not only does he have a really great way about him he it's unique because he's getting ready to retire from uh, an entire career in the military and uh, everything on his channel is is like directed towards uh, a military theme military phrases and terms you know uh, he'll do like battle damage assessments and stuff that's like your what we will say like a post shave wrap up where you go over things everything you know his shaved end it's not a shaved end um, you know, if for, you're going to enter like, you know, uh, everything is just, um, let me add a little bit more of this lather. Why not? I have tons of it. So like, why not? So. So Tim is passionate about a lot of things, but two things that he's passionate about is wet shaving and fragrances. So when you have somebody that's so passionate about not only wet shaving, but you're someone that's passionate about fragrances, that gives you a different insight um, when you're reviewing soaps and soap scents or anything like that. You will learn a lot by watching his channel and you'll be entertained you'll be entertained 
Now, Tim, he's, uh, he is 183.3% on everything that he does. So there, it's no different here. He's very good with graphics. He's good with video. He does, you know, video editing uh, and being someone that's new into editing. He's far ahead of uh, the average person. Um, let me get that spot here. There's quite a blade gap on this razor, so talking and shaving with this right on your face and your lip, you gotta be careful. See, if you don't respect the steel, you will get a speeding ticket or you'll get some other code or violation, trust me. And if you ever forget about it, this razor will remind you. That's not such a bad thing, you know. All right, so for a first pass, that's fine. I got plenty of growth, but that usually comes on my uh, next passes because the way that um, my hair grows. All right. So, yeah, so Tim has got a great, great way about him. He is committed he's all in so and not only is it that he's passionate about get to the shave ridge not only is he passionate about wet shaving and uh, fragrances he's also passionate about video making so where a lot of people just hate video editing he kind of lives for it he, he lo loves the challenge and uh, he's undaunted by it, I guess you'd say. And he's always leveling up, and he's really dang good. You would never know that he just started like three months ago. And uh, in like three months, maybe three and a half, I don't know, right around three months or so, he's like at, basically at like 500 subscribers, maybe just a couple subscribers off. But uh, if you compare that with uh, almost any other, you know, the average uh, YouTuber, for wet shaving, he's way ahead of the curve. So, that must mean other people that are watching him have noticed that there's something different about his channel and something that uh, they can get a lot out of. So, be the judge for yourself. I'm leaving a link below. Call me crazy, but I think he's one of the fastest growing YouTubers um, of 2019. And you should watch him in 2020 and see where he goes. Because I guarantee his numbers aren't going to be dropping. They're going to be going up. Everybody in wet shaving that I know love the wet, wet shaving for what it is, right? But the other thing that I know is everybody that wet shaves, the thing that they love as well is the fragrances of the shave, wet shaving soaps and aftershaves and all the products, right? Because they came from a place where they just had like very limited options with like, you know, gel or whatever. And so this guy is able to give you inside, um, an inside look and an inside angle, if you will, that's new and fresh. Um, straight from his armory, AKA his shaving den, with all of his arsenal and weapons, AKA shaving soaps and hardware, like shaving brushes and razors and all that stuff. And uh, 
but he can add an additional insight that you'll appreciate when he reviews uh, shaving soaps. Not just for, like, you know, the formula and performance, which he can do that as well, but um, he's very keen on the fragrances. And so... About once a week or so, he puts up a fragrance uh, video that's not really anything related to the shaving itself. It's more aimed at fragrances, you know, and that's just uh, something else that he does. So expect to uh, shave better and smell better if you subscribe to his channel. If you do, do me a favor when you watch the first video, whatever video you decide that you want to watch, and just tell him, hey, Rich sent me. I'm here subscribing to your channel because Rich sent me. He'll appreciate the comment. And he'll know where his subscribers came from. And that will be great. And you could be the person that helps them break 500. Or... Or 550 or wherever he happens to be in a couple days from now. Yeah, I'm just using residual slickness on that. You can tell that he puts a lot of work and effort into his videos. And I'll tell you, you know... It's good when somebody comes into the community um, with, you know, a way about them that kind of sticks out. It, you know, wh like I say, whenever the ocean rises, all ships rise with it. So it, it's it's great. Should we do this with just res residual slickness? Yeah, let's do these... Uh... Can you hear the feedback on that? Pretty incredible. Gosh, this razor is so good. I guess I've done over 300 videos on YouTube. It's crazy to think what the first one was with this razor and how impressed I was with it. And all this time later and all these videos later, I pick up this exact same razor and every time this thing just impresses me every time. This video I really wanted to emphasize um, Tim Delaney, the scented soldier. Because you're going to see him come up. It's a guarantee. You're going to see him come up. And uh, do me a favor. Just check out one of his videos. When you check out his video and judge for yourself, I think you'll be impressed with how clean and refined his videos are. He's obviously knowledgeable about the things that he talks about. So you're going to get value out of your time when you watch his channel. And that's why I think he's growing so quickly. I know he's coming up on 500. He's zeroing in on that 500 subscribers. He's just a couple away from it. In fact, maybe by the time, if you check this, he may already be over 500. I'm not sure. Or you might be the one that helps him to get there. Anyways, just subscribe to his channel. Um, we always appreciate subscriptions. 
we uh, YouTubers. We appreciate our comments. We appreciate you leaving a thumbs up. We appreciate the feedback that we get from you guys in the industry. Or, I mean, from YouTube, we appreciate the, the feedback that you give us. Um, anyways. <sighs> Love that shave. All right, Rich, so what are you gonna use post-shave? Let's wrap this up, because the video is getting a little bit longer, but it's worth it. So we're gonna wrap this up with a little bit of Space Nog, which I uh, use the soap here. I love the scent on it, my wife, she enjoys it as well. No weepers, no cuts, nothing, just a great shave. Good times. You can feel the burn with this aftershave, I'll tell you what. Oh, smells good too. All right, let's get in with a little bit of uh, Mysterium Serum as well that'll just uh be a great pull shave product just don't need very much i use that much for my entire face all right guys so check the the in, below in my description in this video i will leave links uh, to Tim's channel, uh, The Scented Soldier. I will leave uh, links to uh, Mel Kayanen, uh for Mel's fitness journey, as well as uh, Warhawk, which is his shaving YouTube channel as well. Great energy. Both of these gentlemen are just incredible human beings. They're great people. Um, and they, they make fun entertaining uh, content so uh, do me a favor give them a like give them a, sub su a sub comment let them know rich sent me here and I'm looking forward to watching more of your videos that being said um, if you're still watching this and you're not subscribed yet to shaving with rich go ahead and click subscribe and click notifications uh, and click on the bell so that you can be notified every time I do more videos. But especially now, between now and the end of the year, I'm going to do some uh, videos. And the other ones will be a little bit shorter because I won't be shaving in them, probably. And there will be some of my opinions, favorite razors, favorite blades, uh, um, soaps, things like that. Just r wrapping up the 2019. And... Uh, going strong into 2020 so thank you again i hope all of you guys have happy holidays merry christmas to you uh and uh we'll see you very soon very soon in the next shaving with rich video catch you later